ran into Jiggly Caliente the other day. She had the nerve to brag to me that she needed two hands to masturbate. Yeah, right, one for the tweezers and one for the magnifying glass. Once upon a time, there were two baby drag queens that became best friends in Atlanta, Georgia. One became RuPaul, the most glamorous drag queen in the world. The other one turned into a sad, crazy, trash-talking whore. This is Lady Bunny's Dirty Dish. Logo is set to begin taping a new series about RuPaul's sex life. African-American Horror Story! Oh, and I finally find out why Raja loves wearing such high heels. To keep her knuckles from dragging the ground. Mwah! Raven just went on the drag race cruise, and she got so drunk that she fell overboard. Luckily, her giant lip implants doubled as flotation devices, and it saved her life. No! Trivia question for you. What's the difference between Cher and Chad Michaels? Cher only looks 70. <laughs> After Roxy Andrews was voted off the show in season five, it was really sweet of Rue to drop her off at the bus stop. A friend of Darian Lakes told me she was super busy preparing a brand new number for the cruise. I asked, how's Darian getting on? He said, I think they're using a crane. <laughs> Darian is a Christian and prays before every meal. Imagine praying 11 times a day. <laughs> Pandora Box was performing on the cruise too, and she really went off on this woman in the front row who would not get off of her cell phone. But the poor woman was only trying to find out what time the comedian went on. <laughs> now I'm a big girl myself, so I'm not saying Delta work is fat, but she contracted the flesh-eating Ebola virus, and it gave up! Woo! <laughs> Speaking of big girls, I recently shared a dressing room with Latrice Royale. The smell was so bad I had to shit my pants just to freshen the air. Ow! With Drag Race girls getting endorsement deals from Starbucks and American Apparel, Carmen Carrera has just inked a lucrative deal with a new anal bleaching cream because some assholes really need to lighten up. <laughs> and don't forget to subscribe to WOW Presents. Did you hear the news? RuPaul's DragCon is the first ever drag convention in history. Go to RuPaul'sDragCon.com for tickets and all the tea you need to know.